It is 1.30 in the morning, I feel under the weather, and my other Let's Play partners are asleep. So, what better way to start this Let's Play than, you know, being alone late at night. Welcome to Let's Play The Evil Within 2. Now you haven't seen me play a game solo in a while because I've been busy playing games with Dama, but now that he's asleep and I've got nothing better to do tonight, I'm going to start playing this because I want to. So, let's get started, shall we? Now you have already seen me play The Evil Within 1 on this channel and I'm just gonna pick survival because it's that. Uh, aim assist disabled because I'm not a pussy. Plum engulfed in flame, stretching fire kills child, slash many, nanny. Oh no, the table's burning, whatever shall I do? Yes, you've seen me play this the, the first game, uh, the first Evil Within game before on my channel and now you get to see the sequel, how nice. <coughs> also if I, yeah, I've got a cough. I'll try to keep a coughing to the to a minimum, but um, you know, lots and lots of talking equals you know so it's gonna flare up again. <laughs> That's why I sound a bit huskier than normal. No, no, no! This is not happening. Oh, hi, Sebastian. Welcome. <sighs> nice to see you again. <clears throat> run, run, Sebi, run! Your house is on fire. We need to you know put it out. Oh crap! Oh God, God Lily! Lily. No, 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 my wife, my wife, and my child, my waifu. Open it, open the door. No, 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 actually, you know, you're not supposed to open the door. That's, yeah, that's what's gonna happen. You know about backblasts, don't you? You're a police officer, you should know this. <coughs> and then, it's not wise it. to go into a place that's covered in smoke. Nope, nope, Sebastian. Nope, stop. Okay. It's going in anyway. Billy, I'm here. Where are you? Oh god, a ship stairs. Well, I'm not going up that way. You really should be covering your mouth with a wet cloth for this, Sebastian. Uh, is there anything of, of, of interest that I should? Nope. Yes, actually, this getting low. Get low. <laughs> actually, actually, true, this happened? true fact, getting close to the ground actually prevent, prevents you from inhaling a lot of smoke as compared to, you know, standing up like this. Which is going upstairs is not wise. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming, Lily. Yeah. Just Lily. hold on. L Miss Lily. Excuse me. <clears throat> if I could move faster. I'm here, Lily. I'm here. No worry. I'm coming. It's okay. Yeah. It's a okay. Daddy's here. Which way is her room? That way. I'm gonna go this way because why not? No, this is my bedroom. Damn it! Where is she? Other way. Yeah, can I control Sebastian now, please? Thank you. Yep, that's it. That's her room. Okay, come on. Lily? Hello? Come on out. Lily, where are you? I'm here. Dad's here. You weren't here for me, Dad. Oh. You're dreaming, aren't you? Oh, those two guys at the bar don't look too natural. You alright, Sebat? Nope, you're not alright. You're definitely not alright. Whoa, hello, who are you? Kidman? Oh, Julie! Hello, Sebastian. It's been a long time. Mm, three years. I've been trying to track you down for three years. And you thought you'd find me at the bottom of an empty bottle. Is that it? And why are you here now, damn it? You didn't oh, find dear. me because they didn't want you to. Calm down, Sebastian. You knew what was going to happen in that hospital, didn't you? What happened at Beacon is in the past. You need to forget it. Oh, okay. You sound just like that psychologist that forced shoved down my throat. But he didn't have answers. You do. 
You're gonna tell me about Mobius. Oh, well, now we have company. I'm here because of this. What's that? Huh. Where did you get this? Lily's still alive. <gasps> Lily is dead! I read the police report! I was at her funeral! We can rewrite history if we want to. Staging a death is child's play. Really? Why would I come out of the shadows just to lie to you? Lily is alive. And she's with us. Why? And though? she's in danger. We need you to help save her. Save her? What have you done to her? Get your hands off me! That's not what I wanted at all. I was hoping you'd come willingly, Sebastian. But we don't have time for this bullshit. We need you. Lily needs you. Why is one of your hands got a glove on and the other one doesn't? Fashionable asymmetry is a thing now, I guess? Nope, not yet. Not, no, nope. Yep, nope. That's an intro. Sebastian? You're awake. Huh. Good. Yeah. Great. Where are we? Oh, first person. Okay. You're in one of our facilities. So this is the almighty Mobius, huh? Be careful about what you say. You don't know how powerful they are. Right. So powerful they have to kidnap a washed-up ex-cop to help them. Hmm. <laughs> At least your terrible sense of humor is still intact. <laughs> Enough of this bullshit. Where's Lily? Can I... Patience. All your answers are right here. No, no, we're not going back into STEM. Or, oh, yep, we are going back into STEM. Okay. The Beacon Mental Hospital incident was an unfortunate setback. Huh. But we used the knowledge gained to build a new and vastly improved STEM system. Yeah, I still don't trust you. Definitely don't trust what you. What does this have to do with my daughter? Imagine it. Millions of minds connected together. Happiness for one is happiness for all. Who are you? This machine, this miracle, will allow our species to achieve greatness. Yeah, but living as a shared consciousness is start with a great. mind that was pure and clean enough to support thousands of personalities. Lily. The mind of an innocent child. You connected Lily to that machine? Your daughter is quite special. The most stable core candidate we've ever tested. Thanks to but her, why? the new STEM has been a smashing success. Until recently. A little over a week ago, Lily vanished. Just stopped sending signals. Then the STEM environment began to collapse. We thought it was just a technical glitch. An easy fix, so we sent a team of Mobius agents inside. But then we lost contact with them, and STEM went dark. Think about this, Mr. Castellanos. I am providing you an opportunity. Not only to see your daughter again, but to save her life. Something you thought you failed to do before. You can save her, or let her die. It's your choice. Wow. Harsh. 
Back into the fray again, huh, Sebastian? Ready to find the girl. Good luck, Sebastian. And please, try to cooperate with any team members you might find in there. I know you don't trust us, but they have the same goals as you do. That's all right. I'm fine by myself. Just remember to call me the moment you find Lily, so that we can begin the extraction process. I'll be out here for you. Whatever. He's not always gonna bring Joseph back. And someone else will be in there for you. Who? Are you ready? His wife? What? Uh, this guy. I like I like the the vastly improved graphics engine over the first game. It's so be good. In there, Sebastian. We're counting on you. And as usual, as is the custom for a for one of these games, the intro is roughly ten minutes long. Yay! Stem entry in three, two. Here we go again, Sebastian. One. Flush, flush down a mental toilet. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. This is weird. Yeah, that's this is really weird. Oh, I can oh, I can move my oh. Oh, ooh, thumbnail. That's a th that's a thumbnail right there. I like that. That's cool. So, can you give you control now? Nice. Yeah, this is, is a Jeff. Where am I? Just this. Huh? Oh, the family home. I'm coming, Lily, I'm coming. Anything else? Oh, Dad, no. Help me. I'm coming, Lily. Dad. Okay. I know it's hard to accept, Lyra. She's gone. Our little girl is gone. No. no. I'll never accept it. If you won't help me, I'll find out the truth on my own. What the hell is this place? Ah, the lighthouse from the first game, is it? Yep. The church. It's the case from the first game. This is so weird. Hello? Radio. 